it is very clear this guy is not an amateur when it comes to creepy behavior. Utica will say when they went to arrest him, he had two phones on him. One, a clean phone without any sexual images. Then they found one hidden in his car that he uses to commit these crimes. People like this, uh, we don't want them out and about. We don't want them to continue this kind of behavior. The detective is talking about 38 year old Christopher Murray back at it again, this time taking photos of a teen inside a dressing room. Investigators say last Wednesday, Murray was in one stall, a teen girl next door in the dressing room at Plato's Closet, a teen store. There was a very thin gap underneath the dressing room, maybe an inch that his phone was under and she had originally covered it up with clothing and then minutes later she saw the phone again. Worried and disgusted, the girl told her mom who was there and confronted Murray then called police. Apparently he had two phones on him, a clean one to hand over to police. Then detectives discovered a hidden one on his engine with the perverted pictures. Murray is already a registered sex offender for using his cell phone to take photos of a 16 year old on the escalator at Somerset Mall in Troy last year. That's our concern where there's one victim, we know there's probably more. You can see Plato's closet closed the gap below the fitting room, but Detective Greg Morabito says this could happen anywhere. Keep your eyes open. I mean, being aware of your surroundings is something we always recommend. Murray is facing one felony charge for now. It holds a penalty of up to two years behind bars. Keeping in mind, he is already a registered sex offender. Now, you heard the detective in this story there say their fear is that there's more victims. If you recognize him, noticed him acting creepy in a store you were shopping in, please call Utica Police. Reporting live, Jessica Dupnak, Fox 2 News.